Good morning, folks. Procrastination is something that you all um, are affected from time to time. We procrastinate the stuff that we don't like, which is boring or which is complicated and beyond our um, current comfort level. And uh, each of us have got their own procrastination uh, inducing tasks. Now, coming back from a long holiday, everything is a mess. The whole order is gone from life, kind of. There are some key habits that you need to inculcate in your daily life to get back into the flow. And one of mine is washing my car and cleaning the house, cleaning the kitchen. Because a tidy environment gives a clarity of your mind. And for me, cooking, cleaning, tidying uh, gives, gets me into flow. And when the flow comes, the confidence comes back, the hopelessness goes. The problem is that when everything is not working, uh, kind of everything is in disorder, then you lose hope. And then that started the vicious cycle of not wanting to get up, not wanting to do the uh, work you're supposed to do, and everything gets delayed. So to get into the flow, to get into the productivity habit, find some key elements in your daily practices which will get you into flow, which doesn't use much brain power, like, you know, washing the car or cleaning. And as you do it, you get a sense of completion, uh, satisfaction. And one of the things in this is make your bed when you first wake up. Um, similarly, tidying your own body, like cleaning your own body, brushing, shaving, taking a shower these are also key habits um, which will energize you which will get you into into the rhythm so i thought i will share it with you find your flow stuff find your low key repetitive daily habits which uh, gets you into the work um, speed the motion and then you stop that because otherwise there's a danger of you getting into these for too long while the real uh, Task the frogs that you have to eat is waiting and getting bigger at least in your mind or in terms of the implication of not meeting it. I just uh, finished this book called Procrastination Cure and a number of key ideas from the book. One is um, if the task is boring uh, gamify it, uh, get somebody who will check on you and um, speed it up. Uh, don't look for perfection. Try to do an imperfect but finished job and then that's your draft one, then draft two, draft three and then make it perfect. The other thing is that um, outsource it but that is not doable for quite a number of us in particular segments of the job. One thing is to address the fear behind why you are afraid to start the job. The procrastination is actually a fight between your present self and your future self. The future self needs this job, but the present self is scared of doing the job. And that's why you're finding it a bit um, difficult to start. Initiate first, even if it's for half an hour, initiate the job. You might not finish the whole job in one go. Um, another key um, point is that uh, when you're doing a to-do list, uh, do not put more than seven jobs on your one-day to-do list because seven is kind of doable depending on the nature of the job. But anything more than seven, you will not get it done and then you will say, oh, uh, I um, am rubbish. Uh, so that's it. It's a quick video. Three minutes, 50 seconds on procrastination I am a chronic procrastinator I, I think in certain aspects I'm very distracted uh, by uh, unusual stuff novel stuff uh, and then I don't do the stuff that I'm supposed to do and that's something I'm getting better over the years I think so but uh, still there's always chance for improvement have a nice day